Hey everybody, we're coming to you live from Corona Queens, Crown City, and today we're going to start our green initiative by speaking to you about peppermint um, and the benefits behind peppermint. Now the reason why I'm speaking to you about peppermint is because peppermint is very easy to grow and it grows wild. Honestly, once you plant it, if you plant it in a good place, it's going to come back every year and it's a great herb to have but the one thing that you must know about mint is that mint is a thug mint will take over your whole space if you leave it you understand but it is very beneficial now uh, the great thing about mint is that mint mint is great for the digestive tract mint also is good for your breath Mint is good as um, as a deodorant in some senses, and mint is also good um, for the ladies, for menstrual cramps and things like that. Also, for those of you that have sensitive skin in the hot summer months, if you get sunburn, you run, so you rub, you take some water, you rub some mint on you, and you're good to go. Um, but like I said before, mint is a thug. So um, the way that it grows, it grows long. See that? He grows real long, and if you don't cut it off, he's gonna get longer and longer and longer to the point where he reaches to the floor out here. So, um, what I like to do, and one thing that I suggest everybody does, because this is actually very good for weight loss and um, is good to lower your blood pressure, and honestly, it's really good um, to stop smoking, because especially those of you that smoke Newports, this is one of the main ingredients in Newports. And um, if you just do use this, well, you don't smoke this, but if you just use this, it, it'll definitely um, calm you down. But anyway, let me show you what it is that you do with mint. Now, to stop mint from growing, every day you want to pick off a couple of leaves from the top. You know what I mean? You want to pick up a, coffee, a couple of leaves from the top and make use of them. Now, I'm going to show you exactly how I make use of them. Now this is what happens though. You see how fat he is? And you see how thin this is? Because I didn't pick this off. This got fat because he started, you know, he got mad, basically. Because the way that they work, the way that plants work is that they can't move. They just gotta grow. You understand? So if you pick them off, then um, then they're just gonna start growing however they can. You see what I'm saying? Look at this bunch right here. It's crazy. But mint is great. And let me show you what I'm gonna do right now. I got a little setup right here. <clears throat> I got some boiling water right there. You take the mint and you squeeze it to release the juices. And then what you want to do is that you want to put it in a paper towel. I'm making, we in the hood, so we're making a little ghetto tea bag. All right. What's up, child? I'm making a video. We're making a little ghetto tea bag. We dip it in there, let it sit there for a few minutes. Now, I usually like to take some honey or some sugar and mix it in, but it really isn't necessary because it tastes great anyway. Um, but yeah, that's the setup. It's gonna take a few minutes. I'm not gonna sit here and make you wait while it turns brown. But yeah, and you know, the faster way of doing it is by doing it like this. What I do is that I, a lot of times I take the mint leaves off and then I just sit it in that plate and let it sun dry. And then it just gets real nice and dark and you put it in a little tea bag or a coffee strainer and bam. But this is a lot more direct. You get a lot more juices out of this and it tastes even better. Now, lastly, the best way to grow mint if you have a small space is to take one of these pots. One of these long little pots right here, you put it by the window, you're good. You just gotta keep, make sure that you keep plugging it back. In the winter time, you wanna take it away from the window because it's still gonna grow well. Um, if you leave it outside, the only thing that's gonna happen is that it's gonna get dormant. And it's going to, and then it'll just come back as soon as the spring hits. All right, but anyway, that's our video on mint. If you wanna see more, send me an email. Thanks, have a great one.